And another one. Battlefield 1 on Xbox One X. And I'm going after the equipment again. I'm trying to be a good pilot. Taking on this bomber up here. I'm in a fighter plane with this first person view. This really takes time to get used to playing like this because they get out your sight real easy. But I'm going after him. Kind of a struggle. He's got a back gunner. That guy can really take me out if he wanted to. Uh, look at the draw on my part, I reckon. And I'm down here. I'm about wrecked myself right here. I'm surprised I survived that right here. I got pretty rough. And here's another one. I'm going after an attack plane once again. If he had a back gunner, he can really tear me up. And there's some uh, problem right here. I, I know I should be hitting him in that straightaway. And we have lost objective nothing was ticking George. off. Every once in a while you'll have that problem. Anyway, I'm playing on the CTE servers. Uh, community test environment for Battlefield 1. You can get this if you got Battlefield 1 Premium. Uh, it's the new one or two new maps right before they come out they put it in this server right here and you can go in there and uh, play along with it and I think they actually probably watch us or something or I don't know how they actually see if it's working or not or maybe our feedback go to their website and uh, give them feedback what we think might be right or wrong anyway that's a good kill right here uh, yeah I like it taking it to them here's another one right here but this is back on regular Battlefield 1. Uh, once again, I'm going after another bomber. Anytime you can take care of them guys, but right now he probably try to bomb that uh, B flag right here. So I'm going to try to take him out or the E or F flag. Anything you can help your squad or your whole team in the long run benefits the whole team and better chance for you succeeding and winning. I like trying to take them wings out if I can. Makes them less maneuverable. But this right here, I, that's a good looking picture right here. And it's hard to fly like that. I, I enjoy it if I can get a good lineup on scene. He, he got a back tail gunner, but I do believe I got a wingman or something there behind him, but I took him out. So it's all good. And right here. I'm in the back tail gun of an attack plane, and this is what you're supposed to do. Uh, he's got a fighter or attack plane, I can't remember which one. He's on us, because he wants us to quit dropping our bombs on his guys. But see the AA coming from the ground, and black streaks coming up to him. They was hitting him, I was hitting him. Anything to get him off your bomber or attack plane like I'm in right now. <laughs> Here comes another view. Different time of the game right here see how you drop down right there going for a bombing run and here comes that plane again he's after he's mad at us because we already done it one time but that's what you're supposed to do always keep a lookout why don't show on them videos is always looking all the way around 360 to help, help your pilot out anyway here comes another one I've never done with a torpedo boat sink another torpedo boat I've been in on riding around, I always get blowed up by another torpedo boat or, or a dreadnought. I gotta make a video about the dreadnought. Anyhow, I chase him around forever, I think. Trying to figure out how to line a shot up. He knew I was there, he just didn't know how to. So I cut the engine just a little bit right there and I shot them torpedoes off. And that was just hilarious. I like that. Now, this would be suicide taking this small light tank against. Uh, artillery truck, you ain't gonna be able to really see him way off in the distance. You wouldn't go head to head with him because he'll take you out one shot, I do believe. Anyway, I got him in the side. I think some other guy was throwing grenades at him. I could see stuff over there blowing up on his front and part of his right side, but that was fun right there. I didn't think I was gonna get him before the game were anti grenades or part of RT rockets. <laughs> ain't nothing like big old tank going after some infantry guys. And I'll be that dumb guy right here trying to come after him. But I know what they was going through, but I wanted to show you all that I can run and take halfway distance, decent. I'll make me some clips in the future of driving a heavy tank and maybe having a tank duel with somebody. 
I ain't the best at it, but I like it. Now here, right here, see them mines right here? I, I laid them out. And there's some more right around here. I wanna, I wanna come around this curve right here. Be laid out by another one of my teammates. They lay on the ground on little blue things. That's his, and I about done suicide right here. I thought I was dead. I, I finished him off with an entire tank grenade right here. I know one just for good measure, just in case somebody come around the corner and didn't get affected by it. And I got killed right there. That's the price you got to pay to help them out. Uh, take out that armor. Any chance you get. And this is the first time I ever used a crossbow, grenade crossbow, on an armored car. That's basically all it is, is an armored car. I throw that incendiary grenade to help a little bit and then lead him up with that. That was fun right there. That's the first time I done it. I jumped around. I, I was happy about that. And this right here is suicide, but we had to take him out. He was just wrecking this all over the place down here on this map right here. I put the mines out, and I think somebody shot him. So he chain reaction and lit him up, but we got rid of his tail because he was showing us causing us problems. And this next clip right here, just like on Battlefield 4, I tried to bait them in to come at me. They see one guy running around. Right now I'm trying to see if anybody because I just got killed right there and I respawn. There he is. There's a big old tank. He's looking for us. You know somebody's over there. And I just come around the corner. I'm fit to drop my mind right here and I'm baiting him. And right when I turn around and start running, I thought he got me right here. I said, oh yeah, but that's what I'm talking about. I got him. I like that right here. That was fun right there. Cause it, I think he lit me up or somebody was driving a tank. Anyhow, how about a little bit of infantry to play? Playing a sort character with an automatico. And this one bad little submachine. I call it a submachine. I think they try to call it a sort right anyway. But I'm going to do the old flank maneuver. I see him running across a hill right here. You see him? There's it's another one right here. I'm fitting to go in and see if I can crack some heads. I've really never done this that off effect. Usually I get one and I'll get destroyed right after it. But anyway, I love the animation. It might be graphic to some of y'all, but this is supposed to be a M rated game, a true game. I'm fitting to get him too. I mean, the animation is just awesome. Anyway, oh yeah, I forgot to say, this game looks phenomenal on the Xbox One X. Like I said about the Battlefield 4, uh, I written the HDR, the high diamond range with the colors and everything. This makes it look really good. I'm in, you know, I'm impressed. I think I'm playing it more now on the X than I did play it on the one. I play it well. I've been off work, took off work this whole week, but it's an awful fun game. And this automatic, I used to hate this thing. And I've tried to play with it when I first got it. Got aggravated with it. Went back to sort rifles. You know, the single fire. Bam, bam, man. And this is automatic. This thing is spreading. Watch out, buddy. But yeah, this is a pretty game. I love the light and the color on it. YouTube don't do no justice for it. This big old TV I got. This 55 inch TV. Makes it look 